Welcome one and all to Dot Age. My name is Deep Space Matt, and today the end is nigh. Only three domains are left, and with my production creating the protection needed for victory, what could my villagers possibly want now? Alcohol. How will my story end? Let's find out in Dot Age. All right, here we go with Dot Age, what is probably most definitely going to be the last episode of this run. We are on day 292, and there's only a handful of days left. Well, more than a handful. I think there's like 20 days left. So where were we? Let me think. Oh, yes, I was telling you about how we built our village and defeated all the domains. Uh, ooh, it is awfully bright here in the apocalypse. Uh, but yeah, I mean, there's not much to do. We'll get uh, in three days. We'll get 100% here just sitting as we are. These are all 100%, and we're above the the threat or the power that is coming at us with our protection so i could just hit end turn i think with our especially with our food production pretty much every single day and we would be fine straight to the end where are we at here yeah we're on day 12 out of 30. uh but uh in the interest of like doing something more i did have a comment saying uh, i could do a challenge and try and build every building which is that's an exciting thing, in which case we don't need to remove rocks and we need to get our research going. What do we need to grab? Remove ashes, no. Um, all of this is done. We have, oh, we have the pub. Oh, we should totally get a pub in. Yes, we need, we need to get a pub. Can we make beer though? How do we, from the brewery or the still? Oh, do we already, ha oh, we already have this. I already researched that. And then actually, hold on. Uh, gotta make sure the still takes fruit and we have a chestnut tree. Does chestnuts count as fruit? Maybe we can't because we don't even have any fruit. Uh, chestnut tree. Oh no, chestnut count as fruit. We're making chestnut beer. <laughs> Let's go. And then everybody can go down to the pub and uh, celebrate when we defeat the domains. So we need, man, we need to get our research going. Where are we on paper makers? Okay, we need... We need more paper makers. We need a bunch more paper makers. So you need uh, wood within one, or you don't need it, but you get plus one, or for clearing path to dwelling. I mean, we got a clearing path to every single dwelling <laughs> in our village here. I don't know if I can get the wood maker. That's a little rough. I guess we could do right here and plop it down here. We don't necessarily need, we don't need all these forgers anymore. Now that I got, we got these hemp going, and on that, let's replant these hemp fields so we can keep it rolling and keep our keep our fabric going. In fact, you're what are you doing here? Why are you not making fabric? Uh, Reko, you're grabbing wood? No, you should be making fabric. And actually, you're using hemp, you're using hemp, you're using hemp. Maybe we want one of you to use feathers. Swap you to feathers, and is our hunter grabbing feathers? No, because our hunter is grabbing hemp. We don't need that. We have hemp fields going. Go over here. You're grabbing chickens. Please stay on the pigs. We have plenty of raw white meat. We need more raw red meat. Uh, We're going over cap on something. Wood. We got way too much wood. Where are our... You can get off of this. You can get off of that. And we need to place some paper makers, and then we need to place our still and our tree. We could put our tree here, because we I tried to put it down here. Unfortunately, with this uh, this terrain, this dirt terrain, lifeless land, nothing can grow here. We can't even if we try. If I try to put this here, it would not work. So that's going to be wrecked. But maybe we can grab this area down here. We don't need all these foragers. Actually, we could we could take this out and we can put a signpost right here. Oh, it doesn't show me unless I can put it. Oh, how big are the signposts? Are they like three up? Yeah, three up and out. So that should cover this whole area. So let's, uh, now that we don't have our lumberjacks lumberjacking, let's cut this down. We're going to keep this forest here to buff our... Uh, woodcutter hut <clears throat> and etch this area out we can put our chestnut tree down there and where's the still cooking 
Uh, storage is under crafts. Oh, there, spirits. The still. Oh, we need planks for this. We need to get the other, the other lumberjack on planks. Fruit maker plus one of fruit maker within two and requires a cobblestone. Okay, that's great because we're gonna put it here. We can place these guys. We can place the still over here. Uh, we can place our pub somewhere, which we need to get going. Plus ten of social building within two. Plus ten for each dwelling within one. All right. Well, we're going to figure that out. We're going to select that, even though we can't research anything right now. Actually, we could probably start. We have a small surplus of paper. So get the scholar over here. Get a little bit of a head start. And we need to figure out... We need... How many do we need? We're going down by three. And we want to get these researches going as well. The bookmaker is using paper. Wait, you can use different something else, right? You can use leather. Do we have leather? Uh, we have leather. Where's our leather? Oh, wait. Scroll. Oh, there we go. Oh, we got tons of leather. Not tons, but enough. Oh, that's great. That's great. So now we're plus six to three. We can get some of our thinkers back over here. Thinking. No thinker available. What are you doing? You're doing that. Get off of that. We can get somebody off of seeds, somebody off of seeds to get this replanted. And I said we have the surplus. Where's our other thinker? We have a third thinker. You're way over here grabbing hemp. No, do this. We're going down three, but that's fine. We want to get this up before, before all this goes. We want to get our pub, our pub going. What else did we have here? Oh man, large kitchen, bungalow, man, 135 a piece. I don't know if I'm going to be able to build everything. Hemp processor, plus one for each fruit maker within one. Oh, that's great. We can place it right down there. You grab a lot of hemp from fruit. Yeah, I don't think, I don't think I have enough time to get like the bungalows and the large kitchen going. We might be able to get one of them, but we need, we need more paper makers. Um, so let's. Paper maker, wood maker, clearing path to dwelling. Yeah, the wood, like we put it right here. So maybe you can bomb this. And we'll put one there. And then we'll put another. I guess we could bomb this as well. Put a woodcutter here and put another paper maker here. That'll give the max. So somebody can. Okay, I don't mind taking a hit on the hemp production for a day. No worries. Do all this, and I think we're doing okay. I might actually want to increase this by more, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. We're good. Let's pass the day. It is. Oh, now it's the apocalypse. Now we got that red tinge going on. I'm guessing maybe... Maybe when you load up the saved game, it doesn't load up the uh, the colorization until you pass the day. All right, but we have like literally, there's like no worries here. We're just doing again these vanity projects, like I did the vanity project with the University of Life over here. Now it's the pub. We need to get our people able to celebrate. The end. Um, this is not done. I mean, that's going to take time. Sure. We have four four extra people. Somebody, somebody, you go do that. You're grabbing this. Uh, we probably need to get rid of this one because this is going to deactivate once I get rid of that forest. So somebody get rid of this. Um, these are all fine. I guess we can put somebody on tomatoes. We've got tons of tomatoes. We're still doing fine on our research, plus 29. That is great. Two extra people. What do we want you doing? Uh, grabbing, I guess grabbing some hemp. Seems okay. There's going to be a lot of just passing days here. Oh, actually, take one of you off. Attract, lure an animal. We got plenty of wild boars here, so we can keep this person, keep our chef. Are you a chef? 
you're no you're a butcher keep our butcher uh on the raw red meat path all right there we go pass the day and it looks like we should have enough for at least one more memory unlock and at least get something and get something unlocked for future runs Okay, we might have to send somebody off of research right now until we get uh, this papermaker stuff going on down here. But we got time. We got time. No worries. Okay, you got a long road to go. Oh, but we also need people. We need people. Do we have any handymen? We have zero handymen. Uh, but we don't necessarily need... What don't we need? Uh, we don't necessarily need two fishers. Uh, we got plenty of fish. We got plenty of food. We can take you off a fisher. We can. We don't need two stone masons. Uh, we do need more planks, though. Get somebody on planks. Miner. Uh, we need the knife masters, the thinkers, lumberjacks, the artisans. We needed. Yeah. So we got. We got like two. We can take down a fisher and we take a stone mason. And do that. Um, let's come over here. We got seven people. Whoa, we got seven people. Um, put this here. Oh, actually, there's a wood maker right here. I didn't have to bomb that. I was thinking I had to bomb that and put another wood maker there. But no, we can put one here. We can put one here. Amazing. Go build that. And then we can, this is still going one more day. And then we'll put a signpost there, dig out, carve out some of that space. All right, I think, uh, okay, well, is there anything else we haven't built? Let's take a look here. The tree we're gonna put in, the bakery, we got the fishers and the hunters. Um, oh, the butcher's table. I got rid of the butcher's table before, so we can put it, we can put another butcher's table back in. Seems good right there. Uh, what else? Uh, oh, the upgraded barbecue. Never did that. Let's upgrade our barbecue. Might as well. So that's all that done, except for the chestnut tree. Uh, this is good. We're good here. Our mining. Oh, the smeltery. We never upgraded our smeltery. That's going to use all of our planks that we have going. But sure, let's get that going. Uh, storage. We got the warehouses. That. Uh, workshops, yes. Spirits, we're going to put the still in as soon as we get our planks back up. These are all done. Town center up to max. The University of Life, it's amazing. The workshop, bonfires, apothecary. We got the greater altar and the forest temple. Man, we, we were, we're, just, we're just killing it. All of this, and then this is just tasks. So that's unnecessary. Okay, and we still have, we still have three people left over. Oh, which is perfect because we need, uh, we actually need the hemp fields done first. And then these right there. And then we can take somebody off of grabbing uh, seeds. Sure, we're taking a big hit on seeds. But uh, that's fine. We have plenty of seeds. We want to get this growing as fast as possible. Uh, you're building that. We're, we'll detrain once these are done. And hopefully we should, yeah, we should have enough time. We're doing lovely. Uh, wait, uh, no, we want to take you off of this. Put you on there. We want the 11 up. There we go. And that gives an extra person to go replant that. All right, great. Looks good. Everything's everything's moving along just swimmingly here. Uh, 
I mean, the only thing that could derail us, because there's no omens left, is possibly like a few bad mini events that cause maybe people to get sick or rebellious. But even then, we can just cure them within a few days, depending on how many, how many are gone. Okay, you stopped doing this. Why did you stop doing that? Not enough paper. All right, uh, take you off. Put you on there. Uh, get our signpost going. Now, if the signpost is going in at the end of the day, can I go ahead and start lumberjacking? No, I can't. All right. So we're going to have to wait until that's done. And then we're going to have six people. Six people. Uh, somebody grab, lure another animal over there. Uh, we have no farms. I guess we, I mean, we just stick everybody on these things. Where's our wood at? Our wood is amazing. And don't need to put anybody on that. Um, I guess we can... Okay, that's done down there. We can pave over this here. I don't need that. So somebody go pave this. There we go. And maybe, you know, maybe we want some more brick. Maybe we want some more brick. Or actually, where are we looking at? You're grabbing the planks. Let's put somebody grabbing stone. Uh, where's our stone masons? What are you doing? You are upgrading that. You're doing this. Get off of here. Put somebody else over there. Oh, nobody's doing that. We can get off of hemp a little. There we go. That's looking good. And, I mean, we actually don't need all these fishermen. You're grabbing the last fish, it looks like. All right, that's fine. And you're also thinking maybe maybe I want to go over population just to see what that what that mechanic does. Like after get rid of these two, just down to me and fear, and then make make a, make a couple babies. See what happens uh, when we go over population. How bad is it? I think the higher you go over population, like it gets worse and worse. So it shouldn't be too bad, but I'm wondering, like, what what is the consequence? So I got I got to remember to grab that. We're on we're on the pub, getting the pub up and running, and then going over population on purpose as well. All right, that's complete. So let's carve out. Wait, what is the chestnut requirement? It's stone, right? Yeah, stone. So we could put it right here, and then place are still like maybe over here because it doesn't have to be right next to it if I remember correctly and just within two yeah so we can put that over there okay so let's carve out uh, this bottom piece no worker there is a worker it's always strange when it does that it says nobody but then you just click it a second time and they go over there uh, my, let's cut down this one too why not no worker, but there is. Yeah, see, I just got to click it again. Okay, our, our fishermen are all out of fish. That is A-OK. -okay. Uh, you guys are still building. So our research is still not great, but we can put another thinker on. Now that we have one extra. And man, four extra people. Uh, fields are not done yet. This is at three out of three. So uh, they're just gathering. Uh, there's another gatherer. We still have two people. You know what? Uh, we're going to stick it to fear. Come over here. We're going to be going down <laughs> one on our cooked white meat. No worries. Uh, what are we doing? We're grabbing this, grabbing this. You're making that. You're making glop. I th everybody's... I guess we could have people grabbing more raw white meat, but we are at 296. Wait, are we still grabbing feathers? We're still grabbing feathers. That's good. You're still making all of this. Everything seems a-okay. Pass the turn. And then one more day for the, uh, the heat? The heat domain? Or the cold domain? I mean, it's the same, right? I don't know if- is there an actual name for you? You're just heat, but you switch between heat and cold. 
So I don't know if it's like in total, are you heat and cold can be the main threats to the safety of your pips, but you're like the same domain. So it's just the weather domain or temperature domain, maybe. Okay, these are done. Get somebody over here. Get somebody replanting this. Oh, uh, nobody, everybody's doing something. Uh, we can have you off of hemp now that we got two hemp fields going. Uh, we need to attract some more wild animals. So let's take somebody off of hemp. Lure another animal with some berries to their death. <laughs> this is what's going on. Uh, you're grabbing that. We got some bricks. Everybody's doing something. Uh, I think we are just A-OK -okay right now. We could probably put like one fisherman back over here. And one fisherman should be able to uh, keep up with with all of those spaces. And that leaves us one extra person to, I suppose, gather seeds. You're still lumberjacking. You're still building. Pass the day and see what happens with our lovely heat event. I mean, actually, not see what happens because we don't get any, like, bonuses anymore. There's no uh, buff or the event. The, the bonus is that the domain is gone and we don't have to worry about it. That's it. All right, paper makers are done. We need to train some knife masters so we can increase our research and maybe get another building past past what we've got, got going now, like the large kitchen or the, the giant bungalow. Yeah, give me my marbles back. And what do you have to say for yourself? Oh, what do you have to say for yourself? Oh, this is not possible. It is. It is very possible. You're gone. End of the domain is vanquished. Very nice. You're gone. Okay, I thought there was some sort of event that was going to go on. It zoomed in on, on that one guy. Was that like our miller? All right, here we go. Uh, we got five people, so we need to train somebody. Let's grab our fisherman over here. Yes, you can stop being a fisher. And then the stone mason here, Rembono, you can stop doing that. So we have two handymen. And both of you can come over here and train. Do we have enough? We're running low, a little low. So we might want to make some more tools. Uh, we can get you back over here, which means, uh, oh no, not enough paper, not enough paper. Uh, we still have four people. What are our fields looking like? This field can get there. Uh, we can probably place stone paving under here. Uh, yeah, that's looking looking a okay right now. Oh, we got to get stone pavings under these as well. Actually, both of you. Do we got time? We got time right put some uh stop stop training and instead put some stone pavings there we go get it looking nice we still have two people left um so let's just again increase increase our hope right i want a larger gap between here just in case something goes bad wrong i mean this is a giant gap here 530 to 221 we could probably take everybody off and we'd be okay but let's get a bigger gap on our our fear domain. All right, uh, pass the day. Okay, we cleared that area out. We can get our, our chestnut tree going. I wonder if we put down the soil terrain, if it improves the chestnut tree. We should try that. And then our still will go like over here. Uh, I didn't really have plans for this area. I was just I was just taking it out just to take it out, just in case we needed another space. But we got a bunch of space around. 
researched our pub. Uh, the next research is going to be... Should we go the kitchen or the large bungalow? Let's do a large bungalow. Like, upgrade uh, for our bourgeoisie. Not sure if we'll have enough time to both get that and build it. Uh, where are we looking at planks? We're doing A-OK -okay on planks, and our wood stores are amazing. Uh, let's take our pub. It's a leisure building. Of course it is. Social building within two. Twin... 10 for each dwelling within one. Um, so we can actually put it here. That's not bad. I mean, it's not ideal. I don't think we have an ideal spot. Uh, but I do kind of like it here. It's kind of like in our downtown area. I'm just thinking about aesthetics <laughs> right now instead of getting the most bonus. We don't need the hope off of this. We need it to look pretty. So yeah, we're gonna put it here. Uh, we'll disperse. That is fine. Our big game hunter, I mean, can't keep up with three spots of boar anyway. So we got five people not doing anything. You can uh, grab another pig. Uh, we can place down some soil. Let's take a look here. What does this give us? It gives us eight. So it'll just pop down eight. So let's see if we put some soil down. Hopefully that will increase its yield. And we can also place our still. Oh no, we don't have enough planks yet. Okay, because we're building the pub right now. Okay, so like another day and we'll have that going. Um, we have three extra people, which hey, we got three tomato fields that need tending to. Sounds great, pass the day. Alright, so much. Oh, we're at over a thousand now on Hope Protection. Amazing. Get some big numbers, big numbers. I mean, this. Oh, actually, what am I doing? I could take people off of. We destroyed. <laughs> I don't know. We destroyed these domains. We don't need you making health. It's kind of like out of sight, out of mind. If I don't have these pluses up here. I'm not even aware. Anybody else making health? Who is... Okay, you... Okay, you know, you can get off of this. Um, and then we destroyed the cold, so who is making cold? On our... Oh, here, the two watchers. Oh, we didn't even have the bath tender. That's right, we didn't even need the bath tender to do that for us. Okay, is that all the cold? We had this down here. Um, yes, yeah, so that's all the health, I think. It's a little hard to find everybody. I mean, we can retrain the watchers, too, if we want. Fisherman, go back over there. What are you doing? Okay, let's get a larger gap here. Let's take you off of this. Put you at a plus 18. We have plenty of meatballs at the moment. That we can do two a day for the last 10 days. And it'd be no worries at all. Um, in fact, we have another knife master. We can go here. Get a nice plus 69. Very nice. And then these are paved over. So we were, wait, do we have a, okay, all of our knife masters are knife mastering. So train our two other people. No, where, where are you? What are you doing? I had two. You're building this. No, somebody else can go build this. Because you need to be down here for this so we can get sort of the max amount of uh, paper making going to try and research uh, as many things as we can here at the end. So somebody else comes over here to build that. We still have two people. Uh, we have a field here. That's still being grown. Uh, what else do we want to do? Not, oh, we went to, We need to plant our tree. Okay, let's see if we get more than eight. We do, it goes up by four. Amazing. Get you down there. All right, I got no plans for this right here. I mean, we could put another 
another tree. I suppose. But we got we got all the buildings that we want going. Um wait, we had we had this thing, the hemp processor. Actually, that should take like a day at most. Plus one for each fruit maker within one. The dwelling building within one. Okay, we need you right next to a fruit maker. So we can and we can move this. Over here, perhaps. Or we can notch this out, put another tree here. No, you know what? We're gonna we're gonna move that. And then we're gonna do this in. Oh, it's gonna take two days. That's fine. Alright, I think we're good here. Let's go. I guess we could have, uh, I, I think I don't have anybody on the barbecue, maybe, since I upgraded it. We could probably put somebody on the barbecue. Food is not, not an issue. I'm just, I'm worried about the vanity projects right now. Uh, oh, you're making cooked fish. Oh, let's make some cooked fish. No cook available. Oh, you require somebody new. Okay, well, we have no need for three watchers right now. So, you, Mololo, can, who's infatuated with L Lano, that is right. You can get off of this. Um, you two are being trained, so you will... We have another cook here. There we go. Uh, we're making that... That is great. We're still making some planks. Sure, this is getting built. Uh, this can get planted. And where are we looking at on like our hemp? We don't need, you can get off of hemp, grab another wild boar. This is growing. This is, is somebody taking care of this? Nobody's taking care of this. Get off of that, take care of that. I didn't have anybody there. Oh, I just took somebody off. Okay, yeah, we're looking, we're looking a-okay. We can put our still here, right there. Oh, that counts as a fruit maker too. That's right. Berries? Berries are considered fruit? I didn't, I didn't even think of that. We've had fruit all this time. Simple food, fruit. That's fine. We're going to have a lovely a lovely little orchard going down there. Okay, let's pass the day. Uh, get rid of get rid of cataclysm. We'll have two extra people to do stuff. Now that we have all these projects going, but I'm sure by the end we're going to have like <laughs> A lot of people not doing anything. Except for hopefully hanging out at our lovely minted new pub. Alright, hemp processor done. We can grab that, move back onto our bungalows. Um, are you guys done yet? You got one more day on you. Uh, we can put somebody over here. And we can, we got people, so let's replant. Over there. Uh, that is all full up. You're still on the pigs, that is great. We have no more birds to be grabbing feathers with. Where's our feathers? Well, okay, we're going to lose feathers, so you're going to have to switch to something else. We have enough planks for this now. Uh, this can go away. That's going to take three days to grow. 
Uh, everything is looking very lovely. Pass the turn. people we got uh, to work we got three people here we can have somebody stick our stone paving on this we can have somebody uh, let's just cut this out oh no we can't cut that out I was gonna put another tree there but we don't have it needs to be next to rocks okay that's fine we'll, we'll deal with the one tree no problems uh, you know we do have free there we get somebody to redo this uh and that's great i think we just end the day and we get rid of cataclysm nature has won uh and the hemp processor is gonna go right there we're just gonna stick it right here and we'll get somebody to build that maybe right now should we do it right now what do we got here you're grabbing all the seeds you're grabbing berries we got tons of berries sure just build it right now Get started on it. End the day. Destroy another domain. And now it's just one left. So we need to let's, let's make a make, make some babies. At least one. We have plenty of housing. Housing is not an issue. Real estate rates are super low in our, our lovely Doom Town. All right, here we go, Cataclysm. What do you have to say for yourself? Give me my marbles. Give me a nice, lovely memory. Okay, we gotta go. It's, it's, it's like it's gotta zoom in on somebody. What have you done? Oh, I've done exactly what you wanted me to do. All right, you, you started this whole game. You wanted me to prepare for the apocalypse, and I have prepared. You have brought this onto yourself. All right, here we go. One more day on the pub. And these are going, our lovely tree's gonna grow in a day. We have two extra people. So I said, we're gonna make a baby. The two extra people are gonna make a baby um, right over here. Go make a baby. Let's see what happens. I think we're, we're gonna be a-okay. Unless it's like, <laughs> if it's like double the domain power or something, <laughs> it'll be awful. I don't think it's going to be that bad. Uh, everybody's doing something that I want them to be doing. So, end the day. Okay, who's our, who's our apocalypse baby? A foul. A foul? Maybe a foul. The pub is complete. The village is saved. Alright, uh, you're out of feathers, that's fine. We got five more people not doing much of anything. Um, we gotta get some, we got the still going, get some beer going. And uh, the baby is growing, so it's gonna take two days before we find out what's gonna happen with that. We have our memory. Uh, let's just get people situated at the moment. What do we want them doing? Somebody grabbing this. Somebody, uh, where's our berries? Grab some berries, grab that, replant this. Uh, where's our wood stores at? Uh, going down, but I'm not too concerned. We could put somebody over here. Uh, hemp is fine, the seeds could go up a little, but we are out of people. So we're, let's, let's get our memory. What is our next one? Our final one. 
Birds. Yes. Let's go. We got a bird hunter. We got a oh no little oh no little blue jays. Oh no, we're gonna be we're gonna be killing the little lovely nice looking birds. Yeah, one to five. Or one to five feathers. Okay, we got the bird hunter. Oh, injuries is next. That doesn't sound great at all. Okay, uh, everybody's everybody's doing something. These will get built quite rightly. Oh, we can oh we can harvest this. Yes. Uh, get somebody off of something. What don't I want you on? Tomatoes. Look at our tomatoes. Tomato production is great. Go harvest some some lovely lovely chestnuts. Great. Plus twelve. All right. Uh, pass the day. Look at fear is completely afraid. We're coming for you. Like all of our people have no worries. They're just having a grand old time here in the apocalypse. Grabbing our stones, still grabbing planks. That's fine. Bricks, medicine. Oh, we can take our people off of doing the nature. That's right. We got a hemp processor, but I don't want to be using that. I want the fruit to go to the still. Research of the bungalow. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, we're not going to be able to get much of anything else. Let's just uh, like we can grab. We can grab this for sure. Uh, yeah. Oh, we can actually. Oh, we can use berries for that. But we don't need extra hemp. We don't need extra hemp. We're just fine. Uh, what do we got? We got three people, like, here and there, perhaps. Uh, I mean, any other projects we want to do? Uh, we're going to build this. We're going to upgrade, perhaps, this one right below the town center. Takes a day. Uh, do we have enough to upgrade all of them, actually? Here, no worker available. I mean, that's fine. Okay, uh, get some people off of things. You here, you here. Upgrade, upgrade. Yeah, very nice, very nice. Okay, uh, pass the day. Okay, tomato fields are gone. This hemp field is gone. Uh, remove ashes, sure. And then just go with... Um, I just start on this. We're not going to be able to finish it. But we'll get something going. Especially now that we got all our research. Max, we have 31 research. Alright, uh, six people replant everything. And uh, get somebody down here. Let's use... We could use berries. But I feel like using our lovely, lovely chestnuts from our tree. We're going to have chestnut beer. Oh, we got to train somebody. Oh, it's going to take three days. Okay, well, we'll have beer. I suppose after the apocalypse. <laughs> uh, we'll be making... It'll, it'll be a celebration. Uh, we don't need... What don't we need? Oh, we don't need the herbalists. So we can uh, we can get rid of at least one herbalist, not you herbalist, but sorry. Yes, untrain you. Uh, okay, we're at fifty one, but uh, we did not do over population for some reason. Oh, you're a bourgeoisie. Oh no. 
Oh, I should have had somebody make a bourgeois baby. Okay, well, let's do that. Somebody, uh, do that, and then, like, on the final day... Okay, well, we untrained you for nothing, but that's fine. We don't need you over there anyway. Uh, we got extra people, just, I mean, I don't know, have them <laughs> have them grabbing stuff. Uh, it doesn't, it doesn't really matter anymore. This is the end game. What is this? Oh, remove ashes. No, we don't need that. Get rid of this, get rid of this alert. Alright, let's get rid of this fear. Nothing can stop us. Nothing can stop us. We have baby Paula is growing. We got two apocalypse babies. One of which is going to be making us beer. Eventually, I guess we could detrain. Actually, we could. Oh, I probably should have done that. We can detrain somebody, right? Because we can detrain these guys. We don't need uh, the hippie. Tila. Tila can come over here and train for that, and we'll. It'll be. It'll be post-apocalypse beer. Is what we're gonna have. It'll be great. Uh, we still have just way too many people. I guess everybody just goes and gathers. Uh, in fact, actually, take somebody off a of gathering. You know what? Let's put a lovely brick paving underneath our pub. I think it deserves some brick paving. All right, yeah, just just pile it on, pile all that hope on. All right, uh, replant this. Uh, another person can go. Uh, oh no, go grab this. Because we are back, we are back to chickens. Uh, there we go, and let's get the end here. Let's do it. All right, fear. What have what have, what have you got? To, I'm interested in seeing what you have to say, because you tried to make a deal with me. I said no go. I'm not making any deals. I made you angry. Let's see how angry you are. Oh, it's over. The apocalypse is over. You have been vanquished. Not quite, not enough. I was hoping maybe for like a big burst for the memories there at the very end being the last one. Uh, good game. Okay. Oh, is that <laughs> is that all you had to say for yourself? You're just like GG. GG man, good GG. And it was a good game. This is a great game. All right, we're going to have a yeah, we're going to have a little meeting here. Well, several little meetings. Some people don't want to hear what <laughs> the elder has to say. What happened, Elder? Is this the end? I think, yes, this is it. We we survived. We did it. The domains are defeated. The, our curse is lifted. Good job, my fellow pips. And now let's rebuild everything once again. What do you mean rebuild everything? Everything is built. And this is the story of how our village was born. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to take a rest. Yeah, it's been a long, it's been a long couple of years here of struggling, but now we're perfect, now we're A-OK, -okay. we've defeated the domains, 
Although we have defeated, like we defeated the, the cold. Thank you for playing. Why? Thank you for making this game. I hope you enjoyed the world of Dot Age at least as much as I enjoyed building it. It was, it, this game is great. It's got that one more turn mentality where you just want to keep playing. Okay, is that it? Oh, absolutely. Um, okay, click. I think, oh, okay, we're still going. Is the, oh, we're in the credits here. I was saying, um, oh, music as well. I didn't, I don't think I've ever mentioned the music. Apparently the music is also like real medieval sheet music that they used for the music in the game, which is really, really cool. It's really authentic medieval music. Um, they defeated the, we defeated heat and cold. Does that mean the seasons aren't going to change? It's not going to get cold or hot anymore. It's just going to be temperate. We're going <laughs> to, we're going to be grabbing our beer, having our nice, lovely room temperature beer for the rest of time. Uh, okay. Okay. Yeah. We're, we're in here. Can we get at it? Okay, there we go. Oh, we got a score as well. Days played, 309, 95 researches, uh, 51,000 produced <laughs> resources. Uh, a lot times 0.1. I wonder, is there a way to get that up? 52 alive pips. Uh, domains vanquished. We completed the story. Uh, I wonder if we didn't get an overpopulation because I started this game before that, that mechanic was introduced. So it wouldn't, it, I didn't have any worries at all anyway. Maybe, I'm not sure. Or maybe I just needed like more people for something to happen. Uh, completed the story, difficulty multiplier times one. Uh, oh, look at all the memories we got. 70, we can get more memories. Can I, how do I get more memories? Can I click on this? Memory retrieved, research variations. Research may change each game. Research slots. My memory isn't perfect, so until a slot in the research tree is accessible, you won't know what building is behind it. The buildings available will change each time I tell the story, and you can unlock new buildings as you play. Yeah, this is the brill one of the brilliant things about this game, and replayability is your research tree will be randomized every time you play. So, like, I unlocked the memory of rabbits and the rabbit hutch, but didn't have any of that in my research tree, but, you know, we could get that. I do another run, and it could be that instead of chickens or other things. I'm sure there's buildings that you need, like the, you know, like the town center and those kind of upgrades that are always there, but a lot of the other stuff will be randomized, which is great. That's an amazing idea. I love it. Scenarios. The starting condition will now be different. Prophecy scenarios. Oh, this story is a bit fuzzy to me. I don't really remember whether the fear domain was all that bad or the sickness one was. From now on, the prophecy will be different in every new story. Sorry about that. Okay, that's the other thing that's randomized. Like we had like the fear domain was our big bad. They were like the focus and uh, different, different domains could be the main domain and the events will occur on different days. Things like that. More randomization to increase replayability is great. Look at our high score. Um, we get like on, on global, where are we at? We are so far down. We are not even, <laughs> we don't even have a number down here. Uh, do you want to continue the story? No more events. Uh, oh, that's okay. So that's cool. You can continue building and doing whatever you want with your village. But I mean, with no more events, there's no more challenge. I mean, honestly, there's no more challenge there towards the end anyway. Uh, can we, oh yeah, we can hear memories. Oh, we can unlock more memories. Okay, injuries. Let's see what this stuff is. A physician table. Uh, oh my god, heals bleeding. There's more conditions. <laughs> that is not what we need. Bandages. Bleeding. Okay, what does bleeding do? You will die in four days. Awful. Uh, mender's hut. Uh, okay, use bandages to make health. Okay, yeah, so this is like the randomized stuff. So instead of... The, 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 the healer's hut and the healer's cottage. We would have other things like this. Bandage desk. Yeah, mender's cottage. Okay, shaman. We can get this. We have a tent. Uh, holds one commoner. All right, susceptible to burning. Large tent. Peace tent. You, uh, you create hope. Very nice. Okay, so some of the buildings, like I said, we have the buildings. I guess buildings, instead of having the normal buildings, we could have tents instead. Totems. Uh, oh, give knowledge. Different types of knowledge makers. Druids. Tall totem. Totemic temple. Animal theater. 
you give hope and you use, oh my gosh, you use books and medicinal herbs. That sounds awful. That is quite intensive. Uh, Shaman, what do you do? Uh, with a penchant for mysterious words and a strong love for all kinds of animals, the Shaman was not an easy woman to work for. Okay. Starting resources. Oh, is this another elder? This is another elder. Terrain, the glade. Oh, so there's like different maps as well. And you start off with totems and tents. And death of animals generates five fear. Oh, you don't want to be butchering animals if you're playing the shaman. Plants growing generate four nature. You want to grow plants and you start with 10 wood, 20 berries, and six leather. You start off with leather. Oh yeah, here, because we have elders. We have Mattis. And uh, the shaman. Oh, very cool. Elder stories, new elders can be selected. Amazing. Okay, sheep, looks like we have enough for one more. We get a sheep pen, a loom, which makes, oh, makes fabric amazing out of wool. A woolen mill, wild sheep, lambs, sheep, wool. And then, okay, yeah, that's all we got for that. Uh, and then we have, man, we have, we're like not even halfway through. Or we're about halfway through. More quirks, jester, idiot, cows. More different types of vegetables. Herbalism, gardens. Where's the other shamans? Higher knowledge, poisoning, all new crops. Oh, here we go. Captain. I wish I could see what you are and what you do. Bard, wild pip, more buildings. Pillar, pillaring? Oh my. <laughs> Mysterious events, advanced cures, cellars, advanced quirks. Iron, mushrooms, geysers, terraforming, holy cow. They're, oh, that's the kind of thing we need, I think, to bring the dirt and make it back to like a terrain we could usable, maybe. Brothels, the sheriff, bigger buildings, wrestling, wrestling, <laughs> machinery, techs, and Rand okay, Randolph is <laughs> our last our last one. I remember Randolph. Uh oh my, there's so a whole lot more to unlock. I wonder how many runs it would take. Because the it gets more expensive the way we go along, the more we go along. I'm guessing at least like two more runs to get everywhere, at least to get to Randolph. Uh, anything else here? Records. Uh, this is everything we did. Okay, we're only oh forty one percent. I guess because there's some memories that have like two up, one on the top, one on the bottom. Uh, hints a reset tutorial. Okay, so yeah, and then if we go play, let's see here. Yeah, we have the shaman and the difficulty. Yeah, normal was a bit too easy. Hard is probably a bit too easy. Harder would probably be the one where I would want to be prepared to die. But then there is, oh, we can't even, oh, I can't even select challenge. I guess you probably have to beat it on harder in order to select the challenge. That would be the way to go. But this has been uh, Mattis. I don't know if I'm going to be doing another run. It is, I mean, it's a long it's, it, it's a long series. I think we're at like 17 episodes for this. So it is a lot. But I mean, I'm definitely going to be playing more, maybe in my off time, but uh, uh, take, I mean, it's going to take some time. Like, you know, I don't have a lot of free time, uh, but definitely I might try to unlock the challenge mode because I definitely want to see how hard is hard. <laughs> how hard can this game get? Uh, but I don't know if you want to see more of this. I mean, the views uh, really drop off, but I was really committed into, I really wanted to finish this out. I didn't just want to drop it just because the views were going down. I'm glad I got a complete series of Dot Age. Maybe, maybe I'll do another one. I'm not sure, but if you enjoyed this video, if you enjoyed this series, be sure to like and subscribe down below. And if you made it this far, thanks for watching.